Hey guys, what's up and welcome to another episode of Bruin Build. Today we are in the creative testing world, actually in 1.13. Since it released, um, I decided we should do a little bit of a texture pack look-see video because I have made some changes that I think need to be talked about so you guys know and have a heads up for the download. There should be a download uh, in the description below for 1.13. Uh, I'm also going to put an updated 1.12 um link as well i'm sorry i never got around to that things have been r rather crazy especially like this pat this weekend's been really nuts um and so i just haven't really been able to there's family members going in the hospital all sorts of stuff so it's not very not a very fun weekend especially um but let's move past that uh kind of feel like talking about it um so texture back changes what is what are we changing about our texture pack in 1.13? I guess the biggest change that you're going to notice currently um, is block states and models. Um, so variation is the basic change. Um, we are not going to have variation, uh, at least not right now. Uh, the main reason why is because I wanted to get rid of like our block states and models folder if you looked in it had like every single block known to man um and it wasn't necessary we didn't need to have that um so what i have done is i've gotten rid of the all block states i'm pretty pretty positive i got rid of all block states and reason being is that i don't want to have a ton of variation a ton like i want variation but i don't want to have a ton of it just for the heck of it um so i've got gone ahead and gotten rid of that just for now for some blocks there are blocks that will have variation that i i want to have variation um but for now i've gotten rid of it um so please just bear with that as i am making i'm also making new textures because of 1.13, the new textures, I didn't feel that our textures would fit too terribly well. <laughs> Soul sand underneath. That's fun. Uh, so I didn't think that our very, our uh, current textures would work too terribly well in the new Minecraft textures. And we do have the new Minecraft textures on. Um, I've kept all the textures that I think could fit well with it. Uh, but I have gone ahead and removed some uh I removed a few that i didn't think would make it um so like granite you can see that we've got polished granite and wherever the regular granite is is it even in here oh it's in there here regular granite uh, i'll make some variation based off of this texture and i'll make some variation based off of this for this i'm thinking of getting rid of on some of them getting rid of this so that they don't have um they don't look like a panel, so they just kind of connect. Uh, I thought that would be an interesting thing to try at least. Uh, and brick, I don't. I think I might add some variation in this brick texture. Um, potentially just doing some lighter and darker blocks, but not changing the color. I don't want to change the color because I actually think this is a really good texture. Like this is such an improvement based on what Yappa already had, or based on the first um texture like the original texture like this is this is far and away better and i think it'll work a lot better um let's see here andesite we'll work with uh making some variation in andesite to try and match this bluey purple feel uh, i think it's an interesting interesting little block but i think it is cool i think it does help um and you can see like this doesn't look bad like brick and dirt and all that stuff doesn't look bad it doesn't look the same it, it just looks different is the main thing um so yeah i it, it's it's different feeling but i think it's good variation that is not currently in that i will definitely be adding in is the note blocks right now i just did it as this one block i'm gonna probably switch it for the download i think i'm gonna switch it for the spruce texture because i think that's a little bit uh, better but we're gonna have the spruce version of this for now uh, just because I think it goes better it stands out better 
uh, and and goes with a lot of builds just overall and a, a better. Um, but I will be adding the variation back in. Same with this, uh, the jukebox, I will be adding the variation back in. Um, but for now, just because I didn't have time to make them and I an easy fix to make this texture pack work in 1.13 was to just remove block states because the chain, some of the changes that were having to be made were a little annoying. I was going to have to change all sorts of names and all sorts of, I don't even know. I didn't feel like dealing with it, honestly. Um, so yeah, let's look at some of the textures uh, that don't ha now don't have variation, but I think they still look pretty decent. I mean, so this is the new stone brick, um, and I don't think it looks honestly bad. Like I don't, I don't think it looks bad. I don't think you need to have all the variation like the beat ups texture pack has. I think it looks good with variation, but I don't think it's quite necessary. Uh, cobblestone, I will be making some different types of cobblestone, probably just like two more that are very similar, but adds a little bit of breakup to this. Uh, right now, this looks very bubbly, and I don't mind that, but I, if we're going to have variation, it's going to need to match this cobblestone style, not our old cobblestone style. Uh, stone, I'm just going to add in the old stone variation textures back in. Um... I'm not okay so <clears throat> what should I do about diorite because this is a good texture like this is both of these are such an improvement on the old diorite that I I honestly don't think I can bring myself to changing them like I might be able to adapt my old diorite texture as a small variation for this but I just I can't think of Oh, sorry. Ugh, yawning. I can't think of a, a reason to change this if it's already not that bad. So I may lighten this art. This is a bit harsh, but other than that, I honestly can't tell you, like, I, I, I don't know. I don't really think that I can come up with a better thing than this. I mean, I could make it into bricks, but then it would look rather different. Uh, than vanilla like this would, could look totally different which I don't necessarily think is bad but I definitely want to make it so that man I am yawning I definitely want to make it so that it works in vanilla as well um okay we looked at granite brick we looked at here's the gravel texture I really like this gravel texture like honestly it looks pretty good oh you also notice that the um the overlays are not in. I will be adding some of those back, or I think I'll be adding all of them back. Uh, but I may just get, I may honestly get so used to not playing with overlays that I don't necessarily need them, but I'll add them back in for you guys. I just may not play with them. This, uh, I don't really know if I need to change the store. Do you guys like this store? If you like this store, I won't change anything, but if you don't, like it then i may try and make a new door and take this door and put it over here and make that the um acacia door and then maybe just make the jungle door this but green that might be an idea let me know if you guys like this door i am i don't care i guess <laughs> honestly uh this door don't really like it i could i might make a white version of this i might make a white version of it as the birch door so those are two solutions for the doors let me know what you think uh but yeah so let's see what else is there anything else that i need to show the viewers hmm um i believe honestly that's it i don't think there is anything else that I need to show you. So let's jump into the real world and uh, walk around for the first time in 1.13. And uh, I'll have gone, I'm gonna go through and delete all the ocean chunks. And uh, then we can actually go and find some fun stuff. Oh, that's the, what the backside looks like. <laughs> uh, and we can go find some fun stuff maybe. So I'll see you guys in the real world. All right, guys, so we're in the real world. As you can see, I have geared up a little bit just so that we can 
you know, go exploring and not die. Uh, there's also a lot of enemies. Also, these new sprites are pretty cool. I like them, especially the saplings. The saplings look so good. Uh, the oak one's a little wacky, I think. It looks a little funny, I think. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Um, but so we are in the town of Moore currently. I uh, did this because there is an ocean biome that I had already somewhat explored, and I wanted to see if the chunk deleting stuff that I want, if uh, you need to know how, uh, FWIP has a great video on, to show you how to use uh, this software called Chunky. Um, I would definitely, I'd highly recommend uh, checking that out to see how to do this. Uh, if you've already explored oceans and stuff, um, especially if you made it your goal to not explore oceans before 1.13 in your world, the, it, the process is super easy, uh, super simple. <clears throat> so I'll leave a link in the description for him. Uh, <clears throat> and yeah, but yeah, look at, so this is not terrible. It looks terrible in vanilla because this is like bright orange. But I really don't mind what this brick looks like, honestly. I think it looks pretty decent. So I do not think that we need to go and change anything around the town of Moore. Like, if you look over here, the main thing that we probably need to change is this. Probably need to do something about that. <clears throat> Make sure there's no enemies. Um, but I honestly don't think it looks that bad. Uh, even this, like, I don't think this looks too bad. And this is one of those texture changes that we will just have to say that in vanilla, it's not going to look good uh, because acacia wood just, in my opinion, doesn't look good uh, in general. Ooh, I probably should get a bed. Probably. Also, the iron iron stuff is in the... I, I don't have the texture currently. I don't know why exactly, but don't have the iron texture, so bear with that for now. We'll have to change certain things like this to being uh, birch trap. Oh, I got to show you the birch trap door. Um, do we have any wool? No. 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 Why do we have terracotta in the wool area? Oh, well. Uh, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then. So, actually, that's the only texture that I changed. So. This is a our new birch trapdoor texture. Does it remind you of anything? It should, because it's the old oak trapdoor texture, but in birch form. Uh, I honestly think this looks pretty dang good. Like, it's literally our texture, but it matches our birch. Pretty, pretty dang good too. Like, it's pretty good. Okay. I hate the new freaking shift. Like, look how smooth it is. I want the snappy. I don't. I don't squat that slow. That's terrible. I don't know. Um, but it matches pretty good, so I think it's it's a good change. Uh, let's get it closer, actually. So I think that's pretty good. Uh, okay, I don't want to put it there. We'll put it right here. See, I think that's pretty good. Like what? That's, that is like spot on. So there's that. Um, just if you were curious about what the old oak trapdoor texture, we're just going to carry that around with us, I guess. Um, looks like we're going to have to do some changes, or we can just accept it. Oh, I can't zoom. <laughs> That's going to be one thing I have to get used to. Do we have anything in these furnaces? Did I leave anything? Ooh! Steak? Yes! Please. All right, we're set. We got a crap ton of steak. Cool. All right, well, we're going to go and look at... I do have... So, okay. One thing is water tech, water color is changed. And so we have the B-dubs water texture, but we do not have the B-dubs water color, which is fine. Um, I think <clears throat> playing with the new water color is a probably... Be, probably a good thing and we can try and get used to that and then change it uh, a little bit but maybe not <clears throat> i do think that i want to change like the vibrant blue change that a bit oh, oh here we go 
him with swimming. Do not swim with axes, kids. It is a dangerous pastime, and I'm only doing it because I'm a professional wearing armor. But this is so fun. Also, the swamps look like, look at this. That's super cool. That change. Oh, this is great. Being able to swim in one block, in a one block source is pretty fantastic as well. So we're just going to swim on over here. And we got going by our spruce. And then you can just kind of surf. It's pretty nice. We're going to get out of here, though, because don't. Ooh. Uh oh. Mm -hmm. Die. <laughs> that is what Smite 5 on an axe gets you. All right, we're coming up on the ocean. Uh, one second, my dog went out, and Emma texted. She's in Italy currently, so I kind of want to text her. All right, sorry about that. <clears throat> I am having to try and explain everything that is going on uh, with my family currently. Um, yeah, it's a, to, to Emma, having to explain to her, because since she's in Italy, she doesn't really get to keep up and she's six uh, six hour time difference so trying to i try to text her whenever i can oh here we are here we are here we are here we are look at this oh it worked oh uh, this is glorious let's just go swimming i'm sorry if it's super dark on you guys but i just need to enjoy this right now because this is great look at this ah mojang you have done great things. This is fantastic. We're just going to go get lost at o in the ocean for the moment. I've slept, so I shouldn't get hunted by those stupid things. The, what are they, wraiths? Let's see. Where should we go? Let's just go this way. Um, but yeah, so um, family issues. I, I can tell you guys. It's not that big of a deal if I tell you. Um... So currently, so my Aunt Sharon apparently is, uh, she is a diabetic now. Um, we did, nobody knew. And so her sugar levels were at like 800. Um, and you're supposed to be at like 80 to 100, I think is the proper levels. Um, and so she kind of, yeah, she's, she's not doing too great. So she's in the hospital and now my grandma who she was taken care of. Uh, grandma is uh, needing to go to the hospital because she's apparently gotten sick. Um, so, yeah, that's fun. That's putting a lot of stress on my dad and my mom. Uh, so, yeah, that's kind of the family issues going on. So this week... I may... Well, you should have a Waystone video coming out. Um, I believe on Saturday. So that'll be fun. Um, but if I seem at all weird... Okay, there is nothing over here. I wanted a shipwreck. We're just going to keep swimming. Um, if I seem a little absent-minded or something, that's just... There's a lot going on. And so... Sorry about that. Ooh, dolphins. Give us the dolphins, Grace. Yeah. Look at this. <laughs> this is so stupid. Whoa. Yes. I really, I almost wish that you would take damage in this area. Look at that. We have found the frozen ocean or whatever it is. Glacier? Is it glacier? Where is it? I can't find it. I've got you do blind us. Frozen ocean. Yeah. There's a polar bear. Polar bear. Another polar bear. Man, I used to not be able to ever find polar bears, and now they're just going to pop up all over the place. Oh, this is great. Is there anything below here? No. Anything over here? Mm. Ooh. Ooh go down here i'm not seeing any drown though Ooh, here we go we're going down cool 
coolio. This is fantastic. Ooh, golly. This is fantastic. Oh, this is just so... Ooh! <laughs> cool! I'll take that. I'm fine with having <laughs> diamonds. Oh, good. And an update made it so that we don't have our achievements anymore. That's fun. Oh, well. I like achievement hunting for things I've already found. Ugh, nope. These bubbles are just messing with me. I can't do anything. Okay. I really want to find some, like, drowned or something. That would be cool. Can we find... Let me let me search around, try and find something neato, and then bring you back in if I do. Oh, okay. So we found a drowned. Here he is. I'm hoping this is not going to be anticlimactic, but it very well could be. Oh, it took two hits. What did he drop? Did it float up? Yeah, look at that. Items floating. Fun. Okay, so... Okay, that was not near as exciting as I was hoping. Let me go find more exciting. All right, guys. So <laughs> I found a couple more drowned. Um, die. Die. Okay. Well, this is pretty anticlimactic. Like with this, with this axe, it's pretty anticlimactic. I'm gonna go try and find a boat. If I find a boat, I'll bring you back in. Oh, guys, there's a trident holder. You can't touch this. Okay, you 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 did touch it. Oh yeah, guys, we ooh, 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 ooh. we got ourselves a trident, and I'm not gonna use. Ooh, ooh, oh. They don't have a very big attack range. Interesting. Well, there was a few over here. I wonder if there's anything around here, or if they were just kind of spawning. Let's search around a bit, but look at this. Got ourselves a little trident. This is fantastic. So I am definitely going to go searching. I'm going to go try and hunt some... Ooh, oh, screw that. Never mind. We're not hunting. Okay, we'll, we'll kill this guy. We'll kill this guy. Cool. Yes, a boat. That's what I wanted. Dude, this boat's like fully intact. It's even got a rudder. That's fantastic. I didn't know they came with rudders. Oh. Just because it's updated aquatic doesn't mean that you can't breathe, that you can breathe underwater, Dumbo. These boats are really cool. Like, let's open this guy up and jump on down. And first thing we've got, bad stuff. We are just going to not look at that. Uh, and then, weird. And then this, oh, that's, this is still underwater. Oh, doors. Interesting. So doors allow air pockets. That's cool. Books, paper, always take that. And then a treasure thing. All right. We may, we may have to do this treasure thing. Is there anything else? Anything else? Like, is there, nope, nope. Nothing down there or there. How about up here? Is there another thing? Ooh, there is, but I can't get through. Wow. Cool. Got a diamond. <laughs> and some iron. I mean, that's uh, I'm not knocking the iron, but but I don't care. Cool. Oh, what in the... That's a weird interaction. I'm just going to sit right here. All right, so I think that's going to do it for this episode, guys, just because uh, I don't want to waste y'all's time of me trying to find stuff. So I'm going to go search around, try and find maybe a few more tridents so we can at least repair this trident a little bit. Uh, and then maybe next episode, we'll try to do a little bit more of a building or something. I've got some expansion stuff done on the... Uh, gypsy camp that i am excited to show you but that's gonna do it for this episode so let me know your thoughts on everything that i have talked about 
um, and the texture pack especially. Whoa. All right. Can we jump out of the water? Kind of. Um, but yeah, so let me know what your thoughts are about the texture pack changes. And um, sorry if you do not like the fact that there's no, not going to be variation. Uh, I just, it's just kind of the way, the way it has to go for right now at least. I will add some variation back in. But for now, we're just going to have to deal with that. Um, so yeah, if you guys like the video, leave a like in real life. If you enjoy what I'm doing, enjoy the builds and stuff. Uh, it seemed like you guys really liked the Gypsy Camp expansion. So uh, would love to have you guys subscribe and join the little family we've got going here. And what is that? That's just sand and kelp. The kelp animation threw me off. Uh, so yeah. I'll see you guys in the next episode.